Right, hello and welcome to the UniKid 100 pound endurance race. So, today's racers will be Harry and George, both putting up 50 pounds or the equivalent of that. So let's go and see how the racers are getting on. Harry, how are you feeling about today? Very confident, I think it's going really well. Yeah? Yeah, I'm just going to I'm just gonna absolutely trance him. That's the katana in question, right there. Um, it's a really nice, you know, handmade katana. So yeah, I'm just going to put my um, earbuds in, listen to some Billy Joel and we'll get going. George, how are you feeling about today? I'm feeling confident, bro. Fucking hell. Are you guys ready? No, I'm ready. All right, three, two, one, go. That's it, they are all. <laughs> I forgot these guys are going to be slow as shit. Yeah, of course they are. <laughs> George is currently pulling his trousers up. I repeat, George is currently pulling up his trousers. <laughs> George, you're taking it early. Leave. Although we call this a running race, I'll let you define whether that's true or not. Running's a strong word. Yeah. Oh yeah, we might have to slow down just because they're so fucking slow. George has turned it into more of like a, a skip. Oh. Just for the record, once again, that is a quarter of a mile and they're pulling these faces. Not saying I could do better. Just a mere observation. We are approximately Four and a half minutes into the race, and they are yet to finish their first half mile. And although there is another car that appears to be coming up the lane behind them, this is going to create comedy because, I mean, we just shouldn't be doing this. Harry is maintaining his steady pace with George Popple still in the lead. I think this is quite impressive. It's not even gone beetroot yet. I expect it's gone beetroot, man. One of them are. Oh, Harry's overtaken! George falling behind. We've actually got some fans here on the left. Oh, there they go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. It looks like George. Oh, contact oh. has been made. Contact has been made. George Popple has gone for a cheeky slap on the bottom. On dear Harry the Pine Williams. Harry going for more of a more of a speed walk than a jog, to be honest. Mm, I think both of them. I think jogging is a stretch. Speed walk's not very good, is it? That's not what we're after, Kieran. Really, no. He's not shouting. Guys, hurry up a bit. He has said, "Oh fuck." Oh. Harry has taken the lead. Carry on, let's stop. He's walking. I believe George has been hit by a stitch. Oh, uh, that could be a game over for George. That's, that Harry, <laughs> sprinting away into victory. I think it was George managed just over half a mile. George is fucking gone. George Popple, I believe, has, has stopped. He's, he's walking. I believe George is absolutely nowhere to be seen. <laughs> George has been completely lost, to be honest. No signs of a yellow shirt. How would you describe Harry's performance? Harry's performance, I would describe it. Ooh, I'm a fucking zombie right now. You see, he just looks at the camera. Jesus Christ. <laughs> the, race, the race is won. The race is won. Here I am with the winner, Mr. Harry Laplan Williams. Sweaty, sexy, and bold. I can tell, you. Harry, I feel like I'm not gonna lie, I can tell a vape. Who are my lungs? So I feel it quite earlier on, but I knew that he'd give up. He did. He did give up. I was kind of glad he did because if we got to this point and he hadn't, okay, I would have given up. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's that mile mark. That's where you're at nowadays. And here he comes, Mr. George Popple, approaching the stand. <laughs> 
Can I shoot that truck? Here we are with Mr. George Popple, our nice. fucking a, a fan favourite, honestly. If you actually look at the stands, all of them flying around your team colours, George. They're <laughs> here to support you. How are you feeling today? Fine. He's feeling fine. I'm now here with Harry, our victor of the day, to present him with the trophy. Now, this is a famous trophy in Unikid history. As well as that, I also got you this tray bake from his favourite place to get tray bakes on the Isle of Mull in Scotland. That is yours. You can eat that. Slotted into the pocket.